Got the arrow. Put this right here. One Pokemon you attack with Donald. Stop it. We need Acerola soon. Mind Jack. Get that Mew too. Get some revenge. Yes! Take two prize cards. Well, hello, no girls. And the French girls. Stalled. Welcome back to my kitchen. Damn. On this menu, I'll be serving you the best Alolan starter in the card game. Decidueye GX. Why is that? That red text always means you get something for free. Free. In this case, it's free damage every single turn wherever you want that damage. Yeah, it's always a threat when there's a Decidueye GX out, which means he's always going to be relevant no matter what meta. And even the latest Crimson Invasion era, he is popular. He's gaining popularity because there happens to be a new card, newish, Berry Master, who is also another universal card, fits in any deck, somewhat like Decidueye, and they both just give you free stuff that's valuable. Guess what happens when they meet each other? It's just romance and love at first sight. So it works. It's getting popular. I'm going to show you my version of it. And you're going to see it in... Uh, I'm going to explain to you. A little bit more details. You're going to see it in two... It's not awesome today. It's epic. These are epic, epic matches. Do not miss them. So uh, let us get started. Today's intro is Body Like a Background by Sam Hunt. Uh, my remix of it. So, uh, let's get started. Decidueye GX, let's go over ya. You're stage two. You take the longest of all the Pokemons to evolve, so you get your nice, bigger share of stats. 240 hit points, better than at a stage one, Barry Master, right? So, it is, they're both hard to KO, but this one's even harder. Still similar in HP, though. Now, ability, Feather Arrow. This is the free damage that you get. 20 damage. Any way you like, it's difficult to block. There are ways to do it, but it's not good. So uh, let's just say that when this is out, the pressure is going to be on. And the pressure is, if this starts chipping away at your GX Pokemon's hit points, when they come into play, one of these attacks are going to one-shot that your Pokemon. It's coming from this guy, more so. So let's talk about this guy, because he counts. He, he This is where the 20 damage is you know, paying a cash in. in. Ryan is beating. For one double colors energy, you get 20 damage for every Pokemon. The front Pokemon and the five bench one, which you will need to fill up with your Pokemon. Coconut Master, your other Pokemons as well. And with the choice ban here, that is 150 against GX Pokemons. Every Decidueye adds in 20 more, up to 210 immediately. Now these things can build up, you know, between... You know, I'm between turns, so if you can uh, wear away a backline, two shot, you know, just fight normally. Two shot the front Pokemon. The Sijuai wears down the bench line. When it comes out, you get that one shot. And that's what's deadly about this. So, that's his trick. All right. Uh, actually, that's the biggest trick. We're going to go, not only are you getting bonus damage, but the stick, because it's this guy. It's very compatible with a Cerola. So not only do you have good defense, a solar provides powerful. Actually, if I meant to say opposite, this is your offense. A solar is super defense because you get to pick up the whole Pokemon that's wounded. All damage counters are erased, and you can juggle the Sidueye and cheat those prize cards. Now your opponent's like, "Oh, I have to kill you know four or five prize cards worth of the Sidueye GXs," and you will outlast your opponent that way, out damage them. I'll wear them, I'll last them, and that's how you win in numbers. So, that is that, uh, you know Barry Master. Barry Master, you uh, you trade up a card that you don't want, junk in your deck, and you get two more cards. And this, over the course of the game, is extremely consistent for deck draw. So, that's how the main combo works. I'm going to talk about, you know, the more special text. We do have the baby version, which is in the theme shop. It's very good because with the float zone, you have free retreat for your entire team. You just use the stand-in to go into the active and retreat to the Pokemon that you want up front. And with Mind Jack, if your opponent fills up their bench, you know, which they will, you'll be pressuring them uh, to catch up and uh, you know set up their Pokemons. 
it does 30 more for every bench Pokemon, up to 160, which is even stronger than this. And with the Choice Man, it is 190, and with every Decidueye, you can easily get one shot on even these sort of Pokemon. So, two extremely high hitters. This one's more extreme, plus the free bench damage. Okay, so, let's see, any other special, special tech of all these that are, you probably recognize it. Yeah, they're in, that's just my template. All right, I think that is it. I mentioned all the major cards. The energy count distribution, I'm using only nine energies because I don't need too many energies. DCE double colors energy is just good enough. Of course, because that's the key thing, we're gonna have some ways to recycle that because I need that. You can knock it off, but I can still draw more, recycle them, and one's enough to keep the flow going. I am gonna use darkness and uh, grass energies as well because I do want to have access to my really cool Trickster GX, which copies any GX moves, and maybe he may come out as a backup fighter. His damage is much lower than his uh, Foxy friends, so likely not. And I may want to use Hollow Hunt, get three cards from the discard back to my hand. I may need maybe three discard DCEs. So a little bit of versatility there with the energy counts. All right, now I think I'm done. Decidueye GX, Zora Arc together. Let me show you how they work. Decidueye and Zorark GX match. I'm gonna play my remix of again from Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. A sweet anime. Your opponent chooses an active. Yeah, waiting for him. Yeah, it's it's gonna be a. We saw the Lunala GX pass through, which we probably should take examine. Two more cards? Yeah! No, I don't want that. All right, I don't have a draw supporter. I don't want to know if I want to get lucky on that or not and go for something else. Here, you can have an energy. I'm gonna play this anyways. Let's see what we got. We need this for next turn. I could Acerola, or I could just save this for a draw support. There are four dead cards in my hand right now. Or I could bridge it and get everything ready. I don't have another draw supporter. I may get stuck if I bridge it this turn. So that's why I'm a little scared right here. I'm gonna hold it. I have two cards that I actually want to hold in my hand. Everything else is kind of junk, so we're gonna be safe, okay? So we can end. Bridget, turn one. Yeah, I had that too. Yeah, you, okay, that, that is the point. Focusing here, we know that Cosmog is going to show up. And Mewtwo GX. This looks familiar. I think I've done the same exact deck build, except I would say Necros was better here. Yeah, this is my Mewtwo GX video. Oh, or something similar to it, so don't, don't say anything yet. You drew a new top deck and draw supporter. Great, now it's like, now I want to Bridget. All right, so... Do you want a shot or do this? I'll be okay. Alright, so now, I didn't realize, I did, you didn't know you were gonna get that card. Let's bridge it. Because we have plenty of Pokemon that are itching to evolve right now. Itching. So let's go ahead and get them all down. And I think that's good. I'm going to go ahead and attack. Ram. And we'll follow up with this. We should serve. Actually, there's a chance. He may get the DC and full burst me. So I may lose this card off the bat. If he retreats, full burst. That's that. Let's see if this guy comes and start. Ugh. S2s. We both have S. Ugh. Two Lunala is going to come in online pretty soon. With Max Potion, oh, I know you have Max Potion. You have to have be Max Potion with this. Lunala is like a hidden Metagross GX that we don't know about just yet. All right, two energy, so I'm not going to get KO'd this turn. But you're going for this instead. Not for this guy. I'll be alive. I'm going to have to waste this card, but I'll be alive, though. I likely will end. So you using that for retreat? I mean, you, if you're gonna attack, that, that that's a good move. 60 damage. I'm okay. Full burst. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. I'm alive here. I need to evolve you and retreat you. Now this is I. Let, we need other Pokemon's really badly. I know this is all junk right now. It's good later. Oh jeez.
We pretty much got the same cards that we, uh, uh, that we, well, yeah. Okay, well, I'll have to leave it there. Okay, so, wasn't I just holding the same stuff a minute ago? But at least I can, you know, pick you up and then do something out there. Lunala is up, that's ultra bad. That's ultra bad, come on. Come on, something, something good, something good here. All right. Lunala GX is up. Move energies any way you like. We've, we've got to, we've got to finish this. We've got to, oh dear, two of them up. It doesn't matter, you can't stack abilities, is it? So that, he's got three energies, he can GX for the KO. That stings. Hobie, come on baby. Come on, you guys gotta come up so I can start drawing. Because we need you now. We need you. And we don't have any other basics to put down for your damage that you're supposed to have. So, yeah, come on, GX me. Okay, no, yeah, I would GX this. GX with two prize cards. So we need a nice top deck now. Ultra Ball. You don't need anything else. No, you don't. Yeah, I'll evolve a third Ludala. They can fight. They can all fight. You can juggle these around once they're wounded. Send them to the back. Move the energies forward. They have so many hit points. Oh, man. We want really want to redo this deck. Yeah. And straight Zora would just be compatible with this because you can just max potion that stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're doing this up next time. After after Hyd Hydrogen. After Hydrogen, we'll do that. Okay, so... Let's all wait to uh, talk about uh, Shadow Shots. Hi, you're always mad. No, you're not. Side Strike GX, there that goes down. Well, okay, so who comes out? Well, the Rowlet seems like the most, I mean, uh, least useful. I mean, I have three of these and two of these guys, so. Oh, but well, come on. N, yes, thank you. Shrink your hand down. Energies, not enough to retreat my stuff though. I don't have any retreats right now. He gets a free shot on a big card. You know, if I evolve this, I may be able to retreat it later and he won't get the KO. Oh, I can't evolve at that. Get you up. I may get the retreat. Don't say, don't, don't worry about that yet. Evolve. I actually can attack with this. But he may be able to. He has a, probably is holding a max potion. Or I can go do this. Let's get this right here. I don't want to trade anything. It's too valuable to trade. Everything's too valuable. Everything's too valuable to trade. So we're gonna get some value out of this. Weaken this down. Maybe force him to pull that max potion before we uh, ca do our counter attack. Now we're not gonna have that much bench Pokemon left. I bet we checked. We gotta super out these guys out back later. So let's not waste this. Put this right here. Or well, I can use this to retreat and start attacking immediately. I don't want to weaken this up first. I can't trade these two. They're too much. They are just too much to trade. We'll think about that after this. So leave it be. He gets another free prize cards. I'm still stuck behind, but I still think I can catch up. I'll have another application to, you know, do two of these and then make sure this goes out in one hit. So he knows, he knows I can't risk this, so I'll send this out to fight. Smart move. And he'll be able to pop the max potions later. Wait a minute. Ret you had a free retreat. But you expect to stay alive next turn. I see, I see, okay. He expects to stay alive. Okay, so that's, that, I may take advantage of that if I have enough bursts. So let's go ahead and evolve this. I want to. I'm about to sycamore. So play this right here. Yeah, get that back in my deck. Gotta get that choice band now. Hmm. More bench Pokemon. Good. No choice band, but you can still trade one card for it. What is the most useless card? Trade rare candy. We already got two deciduous. Choice band. Thank you for that draw. So who actually has more burst damage? You have 80. You could do a lot more. But I think you may be able to get it. So let's see. He has four bench poke plays. This does... A hundred. hundred thirty. hundred sixty. Enough. That's enough. Feather arrow. 
this right here? 130, 160. You have 160. Correct? I think my math is correct. There's no resistance or nothing going on. He risked it. And that's uh, that's good for us. Uh, he, there's no other bench Pokemon. I know, because I threw them all down. That stinks. We need a Super Rod. That's okay. I could throw this down too. But I don't need to. Wait, hang on. Don't attack with this. That's the wrong Pokemon you attack with, Donald. Stop it. We need Acerola soon. Mind Jack. Get that Mew too. Get some revenge. Yes! Take two prize cards. Alright! Sink two of his energies now. He has his GX, but his GX doesn't do anything to me right now. Good, good, good. So, Neolego is here. Whoa! What in the world? He's got free retreat, so he's okay. So now I'm I'm confused. I can't jump in. That's okay. We can do we can we're okay now. And Neolego might show up. Oh yeah, you can easily symbiont GX with this deck. Oh, I like you, buddy. You've inspired me. Where am I? Why is there a verse seeker there? You didn't leave. You didn't leave expanded like you. You're still an expanded. Okay. Okay. Oops. Well, now we know that's wrong. Take away two removal. Oh, I still have other choice bands in there. I still do. Neo Legos. He's he's. Oh, he can come out and fight. He already used his GX though, so that's not a problem. Lock up. I can't retreat. And I'll no no I won't. I'll just die. He just has enough damage to do that. I do have resistance, but I need more bench Pokemon. There's the bench Pokemon. I, fi I pulled them off the bench there. There we go. So that's good. Okay. Uh, that with the with. There's no way I can one shot that. There's absolutely no way. There's even Baby Lunala here too. So goodbye Zorark. We need that Super Rod pretty soon. Where is that Super Rod? It's in your deck. That's okay. Uh, how many Acerolas do we have left? One. That's good enough. Goodbye, man. You took out Mewtwo GX. You did good for me. That is a very nice toolbox of uh, cards. So we really want to sink the energy down. But we can't. We can't one shot. We have took away our. I think we I already played by two removal. No, I didn't. Never mind. I just don't have the burst right now. Okay, you can fight, so you have to go up. Oh, the Super Rod came when I needed it? Are you serious? Thank you, Super Rod! Oh, yes! Alright, so if I shuffle that away, that, that, that's definitely not gonna come back. Okay, so the card we need... I don't want to throw all too many draw supporters away. I could go for the bench line, but I have to deal with the threat. Although he has max potion, so I'm not sure about that. Let's go ahead and take these two away. We need more bench Pokemon. That's just uh, that's that's just essential, especially this one right here. I could drop this down too, but I don't need to. It feels like a waste if I do that. I can't trade either. Technically, you can. Yeah, don't worry about this card. You have another. Uh, all your draw supports are being thrown off the bench. I'm not sure that's a good thing, man. Okay, this is tough. Here's what I'm gonna do. He can fight with anything. He can juggle all day. He can juggle all day. All day, he every day. Put a float stone on you. I'm gonna open up with this. I'm gonna take the Banana Master out. If you intend to fight, which one am I more afraid of? If you intend to keep on fighting with this. I'm gonna start weak with this guy. He can tr juggle me easily with this. He can fight with the Lunala too. So I kind of, you know, I'll just take a straight prize card. How about that? This is 120. 100. Take that. Take a prize card. And and cheat the system by being able to finish him off. Oh, man. That's nice. That's pretty good. Draws. Donald, Lunala's weak to dark. 
Oh, yeah. That's why I can't fight with these. So you can pull down, do 120 damage. Oh, I we can finish it off next turn, too. So it's okay. I couldn't have finished it this turn anyways. That's fine. It works out. I'll end my turn. Oh, I could Ultra Ball. If I squeeze an Ultra Ball out, I can't trade anything. Then I can get a third decision up this next turn, which would be pretty cool. But I need everything in my hand, so I have to wait up for that. Okay. Donald suddenly learns that, that, that Luna is weak to dark. Everything falls apart. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um... I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to slow down and and, and keep uh, keep on going. I know it's uh, no excuses. It may be two hours streaming, but I gotta keep going. So, uh, 180. It, it, he definitely has to pop that super potion again. He was doing it right because he he was definitely making the right move by uh, you know we we sink all the energies. That's good. That's good. So it's only he can move it every time it's his turn. Right now, they're all on the heal Lego. I won't be able to retreat, but that's okay. We got something about that. He's moving off again. So if the max potion works, that would have undone everything in the first place. I would have nothing. I wouldn't have to done that, that, you know, like whatever. Jesus, man. Jeez. I'm sorry. Jeez, man. I still have my two removal, right? Because that is gonna let me get the KO. And that will sink a ship. I still have it. I'm not sure if it's in my deck or or, or if it's out there, but we'll see. Because if I take this belt out, he's gone. I know I have that. It's not in my discard, so it's either in my prize cards or here. We can check soon. Lock up. We're gonna find out soon. Okay, I can copy one of your GX attack too. Or copy one of your boos, but that's not probably not the right move. I can't retreat. I likely will fight with this. Let me trade. Let give me that two removal. Or help me set up another decidui. Okay, this is lame. I'm not gonna lose this card. I need somebody tanky. You're tanky. It's Guzma time. We have only one Guzma. There's the two removal I need. Here's here's the retreat. It's stopping me from retreating. So I have to send this up. You will live! So that's why you have to go up and you don't need this energy, but... Oh, I had a free retreat like this. Oh my gosh, I hate myself. Okay. So I can't rare candy that out right there. You are gone. You have a choice, man. You're gone. Oh, God. You are still a problem. So I'm going to start working on you. Yeah, eat another max potion. Okay. We still have another trade, don't we? Yeah, we do. We don't need this Ultra Ball. We we waste the bench space. That bench space has been eaten up now. Ride is beating. Lunala, weakness damage. Come on, Guzma. Come out of the prize cards. Thank you, Guzma! Yes! Yes! Donald, trade and search with the choice man! I got it. I got it, David. Don't worry, man. Okay, so. Winning cards are all in my hand. Winning cards are all in my hand. Donald holding on somehow. Donald could have done better. Donald knows. Donald knows. Retrospective. So, uh, Donald's abusing his weakness damage without it. It would uh, be not so fair, and with this, you know, the, it, with the Zorark meta, it's kind of tough to think Ludana fly. Although you have, it's still so tanky that without the choice ban, you cannot one shot this. It is only possible to one shot this with the choice ban, and this guy. Pretty much, I'm, he can't do it without a choice ban, and you don't see the baby one as much. Another max potion. Ah. I like you, Lunala. If you weren't playing against my Zorark deck, this would be cool. This would be cool. This would be, uh, yeah. This would be a good deck. This guy. This guy is stretching, getting so much value. And then he's about to win if he, if he finishes this off, too. If he can finish this off, he's going to win, man. Look at that. I wasn't checking the prize cards. I was not checking the prize cards. Now, look at that. 
He doesn't have that much bench space, so this guy can't can't finish it. Does he have a Guzma? If he Guzmas, he wins, because he hits this, and uh, that's going to be victory. Okay. Lock up. Two Decidueyes. I could try to keep pulling and try to knock that off. I have two m methods of victory, but this is the most reliable. And because these guys are getting me extra straws, it's just making me more consistent. So, we're going to jump in. We're gonna swap this, take the, abuse our weakness damage here. And without it, we we would have used the alternate victory method. So this should be enough. This should be enough. Unless I did something wrong. The alternate victory method was to Sycamore and pull that, pull the, pull the Fighting Fury belt off. And use our pulls to get 9, 11 card pulls, draw the entire deck. That would probably have been more stylish than, than, than that. That would have been pretty cool to, to see too. So two ways to win that one in that last final turn there. Victory! But hey, go for the big damage. Simplest, simplest amount of turns to win. Yes! Yes, that was sweet, and that was an epic match. That was an epic match to see. So, yeah, I like that. To cool, the Sijuai and... Oh, hey, Dark Patches. Those really rare expanded. You really want this for your expanded decks. Why is that there? That's sexy. That's sexy. That's not so sexy. I don't, I don't know. You should finish this off. So, that is that. Let's get started. Welcome to another Decidueye Zorak GX match. Today's giveaway winner, winner is Reading H. Yeah, so, we uh, we had a bad start the first time. Like, for both of us, had, like, no setup. So, now, we'll see. I'm going to play my remix of Jump Up Superstar from Super Mario Odyssey. All right, done. Would you like a... Extra card? Sure! I'll take that. Choose a Pokemon on your bench. Definitely not that card. So, alright. We know what he has here. Alright, looking at what I have in my hand. I definitely want all these up. And that's it. I'll end my turn right there. So Weevil does damage to all Pokemon to have an ability. I have abilities on all my Pokemons. Oh, Poltown. That is gonna sting. That is gonna sting. So we gotta get the... We gotta get... We gotta hustle. Best way to say, we gotta hustle. We've got to hustle. So, here's the scary thing. I got this. I'm gonna get hurt. Hang on, I may pull something that may stop me from getting hurt. I know he doesn't have any GXs, so I'm gonna toss this out. These are all junk. Oh, wow! 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 Oh, high five, man! Oh, oh! Oh, okay. Good job. Good job, buddy. Oh, good. You are you are very nice. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and... <laughs> well, somebody has a good setup. A very, very good setup. What a hand, Donald. I don't need this. Ah, uh, I'm going to sm put smiley face. I don't have any energies, man. I don't have any energies. I really need to take one of these guys out. Because that thing things are gonna get in trouble, so uh Okay, this I I, I think his luck is worse than terrible of terrible. So I'm gonna flip this. I should have kept that float zone there. Alright, so. And then right there, you can have this float stone. You can have this energy, because I my luck is just uh well. What are you talking about luck Donald? Yeah, you should say nothing about luck. You should say nothing at all. Like, nothing. So, what two Pokemon, three Pokemons have abilities already. So if he gets this to evolve, uh, we'll be able to one-shot that. We'll be able to one-shot that. We don't say anything about luck. You know, no, you know nothing, Jon Snow. You don't get to complain about that, Donald. That's uh, that's just for you. I've never seen such a good setup in my life. Says, uh, are you Greg? Exactly. I don't know what you're talking about. Floatstone goes away. Okay. All right. So, gonna go out for the bench damage, and we cannot, uh, yeah, we can get that out. We can't get that out of here. No, we can't. First of all, I need my little Decidueye GX to come out. First one. And we need the DCEs. Or just regular energy, preferably. A regular energy is fine. So, I'm gonna figure out what I need out. 150. 
I can do 120, so I need a little bit more to help me out. Although I can't just attack with this right here, which is not enough. He doesn't have enough bench space. Okay, we're gonna need to do this eventually. Not eventually, now. Go ahead and trade this. Make sure I have nice cards in my hand. This is junk anyway, so... Might as well get rid of junk. Why are you trading? Why do you, do you even need these cards? No, I don't. Oh yeah, I do need this though. I do need this guy. So Ryder's is beating 120. I still need 10 more damage. That stinks. That's okay. Next turn, you will be able to launch that and finish it off. What we're worried about this is this sinking a whole entire ship down. Counter energy. Oh yeah. That's gonna bring... That could wipe out my whole bench and that would be awesome to see. Very, very awesome to see. Okay. So we can buy some time, so it's still okay. Uh, everybody here is pretty tough, but it's gonna get pr pretty crazy pretty darn soon. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Seeing my whole entire Pokemon line wiped out would be very terrible. Oh, okay. Let's see what happens though. So next up, I got Decidueye. Decidueye can take care of this right here. This Finding Fury Belt made a big, big difference. I would rather be trying to shut these guys down. Anti-bench damage, it doesn't stop abilities though. Prevent all damage done to your bench built by attacks. Oh, he's gonna send this right away. Rule of evil. I would want to go for you first. Look at that. All right, who's in danger? Who's in critical danger right now? That is one prize card, so I don't care. Nobody's in critical danger. You fill up his entire bench too. You're in critical danger. Do I want to save you right now? Why? And why do I want to save you too? Instead of saving a GX. First of all, I'm I'm gonna go take my prize right now. Take this. See what I can get. They might die at the same time with the next attack. 60, you will die. You will not die, but you will. And everything, uh, you will not you will die too. Well, you won't die. You will. Let's go ahead and pick you up. A, that's not right. I didn't want this card. What am I doing? I meant to play Acerola. That's okay. That's a mistake. I meant to play Acerola. So I'll send a... Uh, I'll send the healthy guy up. You can have the DC unintentionally. And I'll finish, uh, I'll finish him off right here. Uh, we need to trade, do we? We don't need to trade. I'll trade. I'll try it. I'll need the Shana right here. Donald face palm. Not intentional, but that's fine. Riot is beating. This thing was gonna get me anyways. We didn't want another second application yet, but he he may have not been able to set that up. So that's the deal. So this is gonna come out. This may come back and get me again. Yeah. Leave it there. Leave it out. Face palm. Face palm. Yep. Okay. That's alive. We'll be able to one shot that. That's okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna go for try to squeeze into the 3KO with this with that right here. And he's like, Donald, you have way too many cards in your hand. We're gonna take that away. Yeah. But now we have this, which is good. We now we know exactly what to do with this uh, next move, or with this too. It could be both. De evolution. Uh oh, that is ultra bad. That means almost everything everything dies. Okay. That means everything dies. Everything I, I care about will die. What? No! He's... Every three... He would have got four prize cards with this card. It's gonna come at me later. He played the energy right there. Multi... Oh, he got that. He's like, oh, I got this. I got this. I got this. Oh, four prizes. Oh, 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 o
<laughs> oh, I cannot believe what just happened to me. Oh, the basic book ones are down. You gonna fight, man? Hang on. No, I need that super rod here. Keep fighting. I'm gonna play it through. I have to. That's just sad. Yeah. 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 Well played. I'm gonna send this out and GX. Black Ray GX. Oh, that was magnificent, though, to see that disaster go out there. All right, good game, Reading Wee. It was fun to see that. It was really, really fun to see that. Good game. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It stung, but it was good. It was good. Well, looks like you reached the end. Thank you. Congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. So, let's break it down. The Sinjua GX, what is your unique trait? Free damage. Free damage, always useful, good in any deck. Unfortunately, it's gated by stage 2 because this sort of stuff is really, really good. So, we're gonna give it a 5 out of 5. Something free you don't pay for that matters, damage helps, wins the game. Even a little bit adds up to something meaningful. So, this is one of the best abilities. You're always gonna be around the meta somewhere and be usable. Uh, damage, 4 out of 5. It's not chain KOing stuff to deaths, it's wearing them down so that you can land that critical moment KO at the right time. So, most of the time it's a two-shot, and then other times, eventually it's gonna be a one-shot somewhere. And that's your big game winner. Alright, setup! It's a four out of five. There's a stage two GX here, normally I give these a three, but... This is fast, it's carrying it, if one doesn't work... You can go with the other one, and they're both reliable. They're both easy to charge up, DCE, regular energies. Yeah, and it's not too bad. You don't feel like you're slow, and you don't really feel like you need this right away, because he does everything by himself. Basically, this and this card is the key tech. Everything else is just a little bit extra. Uh, Alright, defense. We'll give you a little bonus score here, because you're compatible with Acerola, especially with this card. You extend the life of your Zor arc. Basically, it's like more prize cards to take, more damage that they have to do, so it has more defense than other decks. So, yeah, rating, I'm going to give it a 4.5 out of 5. It's quite solid. It does fall to the last king, uh, the one the one Memphis, Lycanroc. Oh yeah, Lycanroc has the ability that kind of transcends everything, even this one. So, uh, it's still solid, it's still a good deck, all well-rounded deck. You know, take on anything out there reasonably well. So. I like it though. I like it a lot. Okay, so, uh, you know, comparatively to everything else, it really is a good deck. Um, weakness. I just mentioned it. So it's like a rock out of nowhere. Weakness. It is slow. You said it was okay, but Decidueye, like, it's not really that bad. But Decidueye takes a while to get up, and you don't, can't cash in that, you know, special quality as you want as fast. I'm not using any rare candies as built because I kind of know. Oh, yeah, I am. What am I second about? Yeah, it's still, it's a stage two. I think this is the weakest part of it. Yeah, for saying it. the weakest part, but it's manageable. That's why I gave it the nice uh, setup score there. So, that is it. Upgrades. It would just be tweaks to the trainer system. Anything that you can see that makes it flow better. It'll take trainer here out, take something out. Right now, I can't see it. I like everything I put into here, but uh, as I keep on playing, if I've noticed I'm missing something every uh, so often, something I need, then I'll change it. So, no re no other big recommendations to that. Alright, I think that is it. Anything else? We just want to know what you're playing for next time. So, the Sigi was today. What did I play to yesterday? Okay. Oh, yeah. We, uh, we, uh, we did the co we did Hydrogen a minute ago, so we're gonna do, um... Hydrogen. Kamoo. That's the other theme deck Pokemon's in the shop. Weed out, which sounds like a negative effect with the ability. Yeah, if you read it right here, it destroys your own bench Pokemon. So we're gonna find out how the way that helps us. 
I think I found out. So uh, that's going to be for next time. So wrapping up right here, Hydra gives up for tomorrow. Thank you very much, Integrals to Frenchals. Totally like, subscribe, because you know you want to see more videos like this. And then follow me on social media. I'll give you clues when new things are happening. Find me on Discord. And link is above. We have a giveaway uh, in a couple days. And yeah, three days. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, well, actually, I don't know when you're watching this. It might actually be happened. Ah, I can't say that, but my Discord link is right above by my head. Uh, remixes. Echo is. Can be found on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music. I added new ones in November. New ones are coming in this February as well. Like these. Next video is tomorrow, like I said. Thank you, Integrals to Frenchals. I may or may not have other channels that I do work on at the side, too. No more on that. Alright, that's it. Thank you, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.